NASA's James Webb Space Telescope has been hard at work capturing mesmerizing images of outer space since first launched back on Christmas Day in 2021. The telescope is designed to conduct infrared astronomy and has given astronomers a new way to observe stars, formations of galaxies, and even view exoplanets. Here's a look at some of the latest images released by NASA. The Webb Telescope has captured new details of cosmic gas and dust within the Crab Nebula. That's the supernova remnant astronomers first discovered hundreds of years ago. It is located about 6,500 light years away in the Taurus constellation. Scientists say these fresh images provide new insights into what happened when the supernova formed after a massive star explosion. The Webb Telescope was able to pierce through the nebula's dust to reveal features previously unseen. One of those, the nebula's pulsar heart, seen as the central white spot, and it spotted thin white lines that show the pulsar's magnetic field. Scientists say the Crab Nebula continues to expand. And NASA released a new image of the youngest supernova remnant in our galaxy called Cassiopeia or Cos A. This is the closest and most detailed look inside the exploded star. Astronomers use the Webb telescope's near-infrared camera to see the supernova remnant at different wavelengths of light than those used in previous observations. Aside from being beautiful, the image could help researchers better understand the process that fuel these massive celestial events. And take a look at this, a massive explosion in space has been detected and it's over a million times brighter than the entire Milky Way. The gamma ray explosion is the second brightest ever witnessed in over 50 years. The burst created a kilonova, two neutron stars merging in a galaxy about a billion light years away. That's according to a study published in the journal Nature. Chemical elements, some necessary for much of life on Earth, were detected within the aftermath of the kilonova. NASA also released this new image of the Milky Way's galactic center, about 25,000 light years away from Earth. The latest image from the James Webb Space Telescope shows a portion of the dense center of our galaxy in unprecedented detail, including never before seen features astronomers have yet to explain. The star forming region, named Sagittarius C, is about 300 light years from the Milky Way's central supermassive black hole, Sagittarius A. Now, the galactic center is close enough to study individual stars from the Webb telescope, allowing astronomers to gather unprecedented information on how stars form and how this process may depend on the cosmic environment, especially compared to other regions of the galaxy. And finally, NASA also released this image that shows what is described as a satellite galaxy to the Milky Way. In this picture, you can see a bright young star within a colorful nebula. The star is identifiable as the brightest spot in the picture, surrounded by six large spokes of light that cross the image. This nebula is known as N79, and N79 is a massive star forming complex spanning roughly about 1600 light years in a generally unexplored region of space. Webb's view of N79 showcases the region's glowing gas and dust. This is because mid-infrared light is able to reveal what is happening deeper inside the clouds. The telescope is now providing astronomers the opportunity to compare and contrast observations of star formation in N79 with the telescope's deep observations of distant galaxies in the early universe.